To make a fresh applesauce, you need to start with fresh apples. This recipe is really easy and is extremely versatile. The method of this apple puree can be used with just about any fruit, anywhere from peaches, pears, even mangoes and pineapples. You're gonna start with fresh apples. We used Red Delicious. You can also use Granny Smith or any other apple of choice. You start by skinning it and then dicing them into even sizes. You're gonna to wanna to dice these into a medium dice and then throw them into a pot with a little bit of water. You're also gonna to wanna to add salt. This salt's gonna bring out that real fresh apple flavor and it's gonna really help enhance and pull the liquid out of the apples during the cooking process and allowing them to stew properly. Cover this pan and allow it to simmer for about 15 minutes. Remove it from heat, throw it into a blender, and blend. Optionally, we used a bit of heavy cream. This gives it a velvety texture in our cocktail, but it's up to you if you want to get rid of those calories. Remove the puree from the blender and then strain. You're going to want to use a sieve for this. We actually used a fine sieve and pushed it through. You use this usually with a dough cutter and you just kind of go back and forth as you push out some of those heavy particles that are still in the puree. This gives it a really smooth texture and it makes a fantastic product. You can then reserve this. You can eat it as a snack or use it in cocktails. Again, this is a versatile technique for just about any fruit puree. So let's clean. Download our free app and get social again.